Well, hello again, Trinity family. As promised, I'm here to answer another one of your questions about who we are and why we do what we do as a church. One of the questions that I've often received is, what does it really mean to be one church in multiple locations, and why is alignment such a big deal? After all, back in May of 2022, we actually voted as a congregation to really align more of our ministries and what we're doing. And the reason why is because it allows us to truly be most effective in the ministry that we're called to do. I think a brief story would really help with this. A couple years ago, when I was leading our new member class here at Kimberly Way, there was a couple that showed up. And when I asked them, you know, what brought them to Trinity, Trinity, they said, well, Honestly, we've been attending Green Trails for about a year now, but we found out that your new member process was only one hour and their new member process was four sessions over four weeks. And so we just thought this would be easier. And I'm sitting there being like, wait, this is crazy. They're, they're joining our one church, but we're making members differently. Furthermore, what we found as we started to compare notes is that there were things that I was missing in my new members class that they actually had. And there were things that I was doing that weren't even a part of the discover process at Green Trails. And so we started to put our heads together and say, how could we be better together? How can we best leverage our creativity and our gifts to have maximum impact in terms of discipling people well and helping them to live on mission? And so we started to align. We do things like kids ministry and youth ministry the same way across all of our locations with the same curriculum so that we're teaching the same faith. We have the same new member process so that we're discipling people in the same way from day one. We have aligned messages so that we're all learning together and growing in the same direction. And we even are pursuing alignment when it comes to worship. Now, I know that last one raises a lot of questions for people. They say, well, but we have different styles. How could you possibly be aligned? And a really good example from recent history is our Ash Wednesday service in 2023. What many people don't realize is that across our locations, it was the exact same worship service. Although stylistically, it was contemporary at Green Trails and Galewood, and it was traditional at Kimberly Way, the flow of the service, the themes of the songs, the creative elements, and the central message and readings, were all the same. And it was an incredibly powerful experience. People talked about how amazing it was to worship in that way. And here's the thing, we were doing that everywhere. We were truly worshiping as one church in multiple locations. Alignment allows us to stop reinventing the wheel, to share best practices and collaborate in ways that further and deepen and broaden our ministry and help us reach the people that we're called to reach. We spend less time reinventing the wheel now and more time following up with people, caring for people, discipling people, and developing leaders. That's what it truly means to be better together. That's why we are one church in multiple locations. And that's why it's so much fun to be able to work and serve together in a multi-site ministry that puts alignment front and center. So if you've got questions about who we are and where we're going, I want to encourage you to use the link that's in the description of this video. Submit your questions, and I'd love to sound off on those in the weeks ahead.